Mike is on now so good morning hope you guys have had a great day so far it's actually not even morning anymore it's like 12 o'clock so about to walk upstairs get this day started because uh, there's a lot to do today and this week is going to be long but good long but good Whew. all right so focus Get a little focus. Get a little focus. There we go. Come on. Come on. Green squares. Perfect. All right. So back to normal. Uh, nothing is absolutely normal with anything that we do, especially this weather. I have on a thermal and it is actually probably about feels like about 65, almost 70 degrees and I'm hot. I think it's just hot here, but they said that it's like cooler outside. I'm currently waiting on someone to pick me up and yeah I'm like sitting up right now yep sitting up she'll be here soon I hope I don't know all right man so like to give you I don't really know how to like start this off and say this like seriously like today has been like one of those days where like I really didn't have access to a vehicle to go anywhere to do anything so I'm gonna fill my spot right now by telling you guys what I guess you can say some of the goals or things that I plan on doing in 2017 my dog well, she won't leave me alone why are you being shy no 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 don't go that way. No. Nah, Sit. Good girl, Nava. Anyway, she don't like being on camera, but whenever I'm talking to the camera, she usually is always trying to get in my lap. And as you see, she is not a lap dog. She is, she's not a big dog, but she ain't a little dog either. Um, so anyway, guys, like, so 2017, like Chastity and I have like something that we're doing together right now that we're trying to make sure that we do every day and we actually just got caught up. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know what happened or why. Why were we behind in the first place? The book. Okay, so I don't know why we were behind, but we go to one community church and this year like we like been all commissioned to like read the Bible in a year. And this is the book. Like, it looks backwards on the screen, so I don't know if you can read it. And I, no, I didn't wipe my nose on my shirt. But, like, we have, like, this bookmark. That is it. Chastity wants me to tell you that she finished the bookmark. She designed a bookmark in it. And she typed out all of the scriptures. Okay. So, but, so we're reading this book, and, like, so today, like, I like our daily rituals have started with like actually reading this and actually reading the scripture that's correlated with it. So like that's one thing. Two, we haven't started this, but like everybody does it every year is that they try to like like life change whenever it comes to eating foods and drinking. Chastity have I already started this like almost like a year ago, but like it's like seriously in the effect right now. So we're trying to keep it up and I actually was gonna go backwards. I haven't had a Coke in almost over, almost a year in like two months. And like in 2017, I'm gonna progressively try to like wean myself off of all sodas. She's already doing it. Like I think she might be what like in like month three, like almost two months in of not having any carbonated drinks at all. Like she might have a sip of one of mine that I get whenever we grab something to eat quick. But like, as far as like going in and grabbing a Sprite, yeah, she's, she's good on that. And me on the other hand, I need carbonation. I'm trying to work on that. Three, 2017, uh, 
business advancement. If you don't know it, my wife, yeah, she she has a full time job right now. Uh, she's working at Waxing in the City. Waxing the City. That's the name of it. And my dog is determined to scratch up my coach bag. She does that, but at the same time, she's actually currently working on blogs that are centered around weddings. Centered around weddings for you ladies that actually want to learn how to have a wedge, wedding, a wedding, a wed For you ladies that are trying to find out about how to have like a wedding that's dope, lit, all the words that should be left in 2016. Like if you want to learn how to do that, she's going to have like a blog up in the next like month and a half, two months where she's going to be able to give you all the information and tell you how we had our wedding. And if you know anything about our wedding, it looked like it might have been a twenty-five, thirty thousand dollars wedding, but we, I think we might have spent seven. We were able to keep everything on a like specific budget and still have like a really dope wedding. And working on cosmetology content that she's going to be putting out because if you didn't know, she's a cosmetologist. Me, on the other hand, God. Um, so of course you guys know that about the partnership with Bit Branding by now. You see Aaron and Christian in the vlogs all the time. So you know about the partnership with Bit Branding, and then also I'm going to be continuing to pursue my my career as a fashion photographer as well. So like I know it sounds like I have a lot of irons in the fire, but because they don't contradict each other, it's like basically like doing one thing for a long period of time, and then actually just like perfecting that craft in the little bit of time that I have left. So like, I'm not putting anything on the back burner. Everything is extremely scheduled in and like scheduled out. So like everything is working out the way that it's supposed to. And I know it sounds like I'm all over the place, but I guess you can say the major goals that you, my wife and I both have like, like entailed together are to grow spiritually, grow uh, businesses that will provide wealth for our family and then three to be a little bit healthier this year so that next year we can be even healthier i don't think you should try to set a resolution i think you should try to do what like some people call life change which is really like you evaluating how you were in 2016 finding the things that you wish that you've done better and finding the things out about yourself that you absolutely hate and that are harmful to yourself and are harmful to other people and you should change those things. That way you can move forward in your life and progress and grow.